What's going on, Adventure Seekers? It's Ryan from CB Adventure Supply, and today we're here in the store with uh, Mark from Red Art to talk about some cool new products they have, and uh, I'll let him kind of introduce them, but they've made some big advancements in the vehicle and trailer lithium charging, AGM charging even, yeah, really. Yeah, even, yeah. Yeah, so, absolutely. Why don't you tell us a little bit about uh, the new BCDC you guys yeah. have, Mark? Thanks, Ryan. So the BCDC Alpha, is our new product. It's available in 25 and 50 amp models. You'll notice it's a big difference, a big change up considering what we used to have. Um, now, no longer do we have uh, fly leads, we have bolt on terminals, so you can terminate your cabling directly to the charger. It makes it a lot neater and a lot easier for installation. Um, we also have uh, a number of unique features that are first, I think, for the industry. Yeah. We have an automated start battery charge back. So once your auxiliary battery is 100%, the available solar energy that is on the roof or uh, that you have connected and available to your system, it'll channel that back to your start battery. So this will uh, be able to maintain your start battery at 100% also. Okay, so that means if my lithium batteries in my trailer camper yes, reach 100% state of charge yep. with my solar panels, uh -huh. this will now charge my vehicle start battery as well, Yeah, correct? yeah, yeah. So using a like a lead acid profile, like an AGM charge profile, we'll use the energy from the solar panel and put it back through to your start battery until it's 100% as well. Oh, that's pretty slick. But that's not all. Oh, that's not all. <laughs> hang on, okay. hang on. We also have a start, <laughs> a start battery recovery mode. So okay. in the event that your start battery is flat, by the press of a button here, or using your mobile phone app, you can force a fast 15 minute charge back to your start battery. So after 15 minutes, you have enough energy in your starter battery to start your truck. Okay, so it's not jump starting my Not vehicle. jump starting, no. What we're doing is we're utilizing the power we have in our stored power system and we're pushing it back into the vehicle yes, battery. Correct. So we have enough juice to turn the motor over and get me going again. Correct, yes. Yeah. So depending on which model you use, so if it's a 25 or a 50, the 50 amp model has the ability to put back 50 amp charge back to your start battery for fast recovery. Oh, okay. That's pretty slick. Yeah, it's really slick. Yeah, 100%. Now, you mentioned a mobile app. So we, I, I'm familiar with the Red Vision yep. app. Same right? app. Same app. Same okay. app, yep. So that'll <clears throat> allow you to program the charging so, uh, system. So you'll be able to uh, maybe instigate um, uh, a fast battery recovery mode, or you'll be able to set what your maximum charge current output is, or even for certain vehicles or certain applications where you want to limit how much power you're taking from the start battery. Uh -huh. So let's say, for example, I've got a trailer with some lithium batteries in it, but I'm at the moment, I'm only charging through my seven way. Uh -huh. So you'll be able to program this unit to only take a maximum, say 10 amps from the vehicle input through the seven way to charge your auxiliary batteries while you're on the move. However, the 600 watts worth of solar panels yeah, on the roof okay. are going to give you the, the 30 amps worth of power. Right. So a combined uh, 40 amps worth of charging power to your lithium batteries. Nice, nice, I like that. And the app, so we're also familiar with like uh, the Manager 30 and yep. the new Alpha Series managers, yes. correct? Yes, sir. And through the app, we get data. Yep. So we can see current flow. Yes. We get all that same features through the BCDC Alpha. Now, yeah, right? so the BCDC Alpha with its app, because it has a shunt inbuilt on, on the inside of this product, it'll show you the charging current output, but it won't show you how much power that you're pulling from your accessories from your auxiliary battery. And that's where something like the, the, this guy. The smart battery monitor comes yes. into play. Right. Correct. So at, at a point, there will be an R bus version of this yes. that'll communicate Correct. with the smart shunt, right? Yeah, and give us everything on the screen, just like we would have with the Manager 30 or any of the new Alpha series. Yeah, managers. yeah, that's exactly right. But another uh, feature of the, the new BCDC Alpha series is the fact that we have a H profile. So we have a charging profile here for lithium heated batteries. Okay. Yep. So. The kit includes a temperature probe as well, so that simply connects to the uh, the, the BCDC Alpha and then uh, connects onto the uh, battery terminal of your auxiliary battery. So we can monitor what the temperature is of the battery and adjust our charging profile to suit. Okay, yeah, because if it's 
hotter, we may need to bring current Back it down. off, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. 100%, yes. okay. So we do that. So heated lithium's a, another big game changer for us. Right. Um, that we have the charging profile for that now too. Now, in, you said the app, but we can also program this just via the button on oh, the side, yeah, correct? Yeah, correct. So we don't need an app to do the... the no, the, no. So follow, following the instructions, you can cycle through your different menus and then you can program it straight from this one button or instigate a, uh, a start battery recovery mode by just holding your finger on the button okay. for a certain amount of time and then that will automatically trigger a uh, start battery recovery. That's pretty slick, man. Yep. I really like that. Now the form factor is still pretty compact. Yeah. Comparing because the the 50 amp is the same size as the 25 amp. Exactly right? the same size. The same as our standard classic range. Right. You no, know, the the size is, is the same, but its output current changes. So this also has an IP rating. Oh, so okay. uh, we we have an IP rating, so we have protection against moisture and uh, vibration. Yeah. Um, whereas the uh, the the Classic Series never had an IP rating because we fully encapsulated the electronics in like a two-part silicon elastomer. But the reason why we couldn't get an IP rating for it is because the enclosure wasn't sealed. Uh -huh. We'd let the water in, but we'd let the water out. Yeah. Right? 100%. So, but with this one, we don't let the water in. It, 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 it is a, it's, it's a sealed, sealed enclosure. Unit. Okay. Correct, correct. Slick. Yeah. That's really, really nice. So the BCDC Alpha has a number of LEDs located on the, on the uh, on the edge of the product. So the icons for what these LEDs uh, mean is on both the, the the front side and also the uh, I guess the forefront of yeah, the, of the, the charger, the top way, of the charger. Yeah. yeah. So with what these icons mean is uh, we've got a picture of the sun, so we know that we're getting charged from solar. We've got a picture of a vehicle, so we know we're getting charged from the vehicle, and then we have our um, flat halfway and full charged battery. So that's kind of a like a boost and absorption and a flight Yeah, it's kind of like mode. the stage light on oh, the of, classic, right? Of the right? classic range, correct, yeah. correct. We also have the um, the start battery recovery mode or the charge back um, icon. And then we have our uh, four different charging profiles. So we have A, B, H, and L, I. So A is pretty much for any acid battery. Um, B is for a little bit higher voltage in your lead acid batteries. I suggest for any mobile applications you wouldn't likely use that or need to use that. But then we have H for heated lithium and then we have LI for just your standard lithium batteries that don't have an internal heater. And then we have our program button and then following the instructions we can uh, set up the charger for your different batteries yeah. or your different system requirements. Okay, cool. The BCDC Alpha range also has inbuilt Bluetooth. So you can connect directly to your mobile device and see your uh, your charging performance straight from the product. Right, so the Red Vision app gives yep. us visibility as to what it's doing, but there is a Red Vision configurator app that we use for the programming and the setup of the device. Yeah, correct, correct. <coughs> correct. Otherwise, you can program the units directly from this one button here, or you can use the Red Vision configurator app to program the device. Okay or via Bluetooth. So if I were to start building out uh, a basic power system in my vehicle, um, other, aside from a battery to store it, yep. this is kind of like the starting block, right? This is my foundation. Yeah. I can add other things down the road, Absolutely. but this is really all I need to get started. 100%, so it comes with the temperature probe to go directly onto your battery. From there, you'd probably go to a, uh, a smart battery monitor to, to measure the current going out of your battery and also provide you, uh, I guess, the state of charge of your battery, like how yeah. full it is. And what this will also do for you, the smart battery monitor, is also tell you how many days and hours you have left in your battery. At your current discharge yeah. rate, yeah, yeah. Exactly, I mean, nobody really understands amp hours, <laughs> like, what's that really mean? But I understand time, right? Yeah. <laughs> and if somebody tells me I've got five hours left, yeah. if I keep this inverter on, yeah. I know I've got five hours left. Yeah, 100%, well that's great information. <laughs> yeah. And then, I guess, aside from that, next big step would be like adding in a Rogue, right? Yeah, you know, the to, Rogue distribution module. Yeah, so yep. I can control my switching for lights or USB ports or whatever I've yeah. got in yeah. my camper, my... Your fridge, your inverter, mm -hmm. water tanks. You yeah. know, the Rogue is the distribution module to control all of your accessories. Yeah, but I think this is a great starting point 100%. to get that power system going. Yeah. And then from there, as my needs change, 
we can advance. build on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. Absolutely. Cool. Well, this will be the core foundation for yeah. sure. Well, I can see where there's quite a few applications we do here in the store where this will take place of that and and give you so much more in yeah. a very similar size and form factor. Yeah, and, and the ease of installation, I mean, this one, you know, it still has a maximum PowerPoint tracking solar regulator as well. Right. Right, so you have the DC-DC charger, you're a maximum PowerPoint tracking solar regulator, you're a, uh, a, a main start battery isolator, yeah. you've got the charge back feature, yeah. you've got the start battery recovery, recovery. feature. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what doesn't this have? I it don't does, know. It, it, it has everything. Yeah. Um, yeah. And it does have the ability to, um, green energy preferred, correct? Yeah, yeah. So, so if we are charging off the vehicle and we have solar, fixed solar mounted on the vehicle yeah. or the trailer, yes. it's going to be using as much of the green energy yeah. and supplementing with the, the vehicle, correct? Correct, correct, yeah. So we call it green priority power. So we'll always take what we can from the solar in the first instance and then supplement the extra energy required from the vehicle. I love it. Yeah. I, I, I really do. I think this is, uh, a good next step from the classic BCDC. Yeah. And it's fully designed and manufactured in Australia. I mean, there's a lot of great products that come out of Australia, great. and I think this is gonna be right up there at the top of that list. Thanks, uh, Roman. I'm, I'm That's super awesome. excited. Um, you can find these on our website or come in our store. Um, we're happy to talk through building out a power system for you where you can DIY install it or we can install it for you. But I really think that the new uh, offering from Red Arc in the Alpha series is gonna be a game changer for electrics for overland and vehicle-based travel. So thanks again for coming in, Mark. Thanks, Ryan. Yeah. Right, thank you. You too.